In this next video of our mapped walkthrough, I want to talk about courses. Now, courses is kind of the heart and soul of mapped because you have to take a lot of courses to get into medical school. And obviously, as an undergrad student, a post bac student, a master's student, wherever you are, you are taking classes to prove your academic abilities. Now, in the onboarding, process, I selected, because we have the data for other students who also go to University of Florida, which is the school that I entered, I pre-selected classes that I also took. And if you did that, you'll see a list of classes here with lots of little red eyes on the side. And these are just saying, hey, this course is missing a grade. And so if it's in the future, that's okay. But these were already taken. So let's go ahead and and show you how to enter information based on these courses. Now, I'm gonna go straight to general chemistry one. I remember very clearly taking that freshman year, big auditorium. You click on that course and you're taken to this course entry page. Now, I'm gonna say that this was taken in the fall of the 2019, 2020 year. I was an undergraduate student. I was definitely a freshman. And you know what? I got an A. Now, when you enter courses in a different way, and I'll show you that, the prereqs are pre-selected. But uh, right now, if you enter courses in the onboarding process, the grades are not pre-selected. And I know just from doing this that chemistry fulfills a science prereq, a uh, for the MD school, the AMCAS application, for the DO application or the ACOMIS application, and also for TMDSAS or the Texas application. This wasn't online, it wasn't a repeat, and it's not a quarter system. And here we allow you to add some reflections. Say so this course was pretty great. I can also add a professor here, but I'm not going to do that now. I'm going to show you how to add contact information later. So this is how you add a course when you add courses through the onboarding process. But what about if you want to add courses, new courses that you didn't add through the onboarding process, or maybe we don't have enough data to offer you onboarding courses to pre-select. Come back to your courses. Actually, we want to save this first. Well, I didn't save it. That's okay. Um, you are going to click here, uh, again, on courses on the, the side, and then on add new course. And right now, as I'm recording this, you're going to get a little pop-up that says, hey, we're in beta for this specific feature. If you select a course that we feel meets a prereq or we feel counts as a science course for your science GPA, we're going to automatically select those things. If you don't agree with them, you can uncheck them, but here's what we think, okay? So you can either say got it or don't show again. I'm just going to say got it for now. And you can see that University of Florida is selected here. And I'm going to say that I took pre-calculus because I did. So I'm going to put in here pre-calculus. And guess what? We have pre-calculus here, Mac 1142. So I'm going to select that. And you can see that math is filled as a prereq. And my science GPA, because math counts as a science GPA for the MD application for AMCAS, and it also counts as a science GPA for Texas. But it doesn't count as science GPA for the DO application for ACOMAS. And that's OK. I'm going to select the term. Again, it was fall in the year 2019, 2020. I was still an undergraduate. I got an A, and it was three credits. So I'm going to save my course. All right, so now you can start to see some things happening. Well, automatically, I'm taken right back to course entry in case I want to enter more courses. You can see that the fall term, the year, the program type, and the class standing are all pre-filled based on the previous entry. And so this will allow you to have some faster data entry when you first start to use mapped. But something else that you can see, I'm gonna close this, is that now I'm starting to get some GPA calculations here at the top. AMCAS, ACOMAS, and TMDSAS all have my 4.0 because it's one class with an A in there.